Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Leo. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. I bet you thought this was never going to get done or that you were going to be last, but I guess that's not the case, is it? So what do we have for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? What do we have for Leo? Keep in mind that the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you. Okay, this reading may or may not be for you. This reading could happen in the next couple of days, could happen in a week from now, okay? Okay, we got three cards that came up flopping out. Oh, four, four. So four is universal protection, right? It's about foundations. There's universal guidance here. Pay attention to the signs, okay? Whale, great worry over nothing. Ooh, throne, position of authority. Unicorn, use your intuition to make beneficial changes. January, January, January. So something to do with the month of January. I think that there's something is going to happen in January forward because this has ended up in a future position. So something is going to happen in January. You're worrying over nothing. Things, I think, that you could also be dealing with somebody that is born in the month of January. Or, you know, you could also, something could be coming back around that started in January. Um, you are in a position of authority. You have to use your intuition to make some sort of changes. Somehow, January is very prominent. You're worrying for no reason. So what do we have for Leo? What do we have for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Rejection is God's protection. I feel like you've dealt with a skilled player, okay, because we got a skilled player on the bottom. You may have rejected this person or they rejected you. It was protection, okay, it was definitely God's protection. You are definitely dealing with a player, maybe this person was born in January or something like that. Doesn't have to be. Um, rejection is God's protection. One more card. I don't know why I feel like I gotta get one more of these for you. Ooh, there's gonna be an increase in money. This is, it could be this way, it could be this way. This is going up. If your, your revenue is gonna be going up, your money is gonna be going up, maybe you start to see the uptick in January. For something that you do right now, okay? You need to do something right now. Your intuition knows what you need to do to get this increase, okay? You need to listen. You need to listen to your intuition. You are sitting on some sort of throne. You may not know it. If you're not, you're going to be, okay? Uh, what do we have for Leo? You're going to see an increase. And it's going to start now, but I think in January, you're really going to see it. What do we got? What do we got for Leo? I think that you must be getting to know somebody. Getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. So you must be deepening a bond with somebody. Getting to know somebody. You need to make the effort. Don't give up, okay? Don't go cold because I keep looking at that January card and it's very cold. Do not be cold in this connection. Be warm, okay? Make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you are guided to take. And remember, I said four. Fours are 
Pay attention to the signs. It's universal guidance. It is divine protection. It's universal protection. And we have rejection is God's protection. So it's interesting because I got two of the blue cards and two of these cards, but each was four. And then we got four of these. So something about fours. 444, four, four. I don't know, something to do with January, something to do with four. Rejection is God's protection. Uh, fours are uh, the angels. They're, it's an angel number, so there's angels around. There's protection here. You're going to see an increase. You are in a position of authority. You need to continue to make the effort. You are going to be getting to know somebody. You may be getting to know somebody right now. Make sure that you reveal. Do not hold back. Do not go cold. Make sure that you are warm. Okay? You are warm with this person. So what do we have? What do we have for Leo? Tha. Sorry. You need the tha. You need the tha a little bit. What do we have for Leo? I don't know. I just saw the Knight of Swords. So I don't know if you have a knight in shining armor or somebody that is rushed into your life or they have just arrived into your life and they're, they've come in it. They've, they've arrived. They've, they're here. They're like right in front of you and you're like, oh my God, what do I do now? Um, Queen of Pentacles reversed. Two of Swords. Nine of Wands. Somebody has their guard up. They really have their guard up. Expecting trouble. What's what? what I don't, you know. <laughs> you're expecting trouble now, aren't you? You are. Total blockage. Like blocking. It's like, oh, I don't dare to open up. This is insecure. You got some insecures, insecurities here. Not really communicating. Eight of Wands reversed. Page of Cups reversed. Ah, oh, God. Three of Pentacles reversed. Five of Wands. Justice upright. Thank you, Lord. Getting what you deserve. Getting the justice you deserve. Everything turning out in your favor. If you're going to court and you're dealing with somebody that uh, is trying to block you in some way. There's blockage like in three of these cards. Somebody's trying to block you from something. It's not going to go in their favor. It's going to go in your favor. I think that you have your guard up and I think you do for good reason because I feel like you have somebody around you that doesn't want to pay or they don't want to give you what you deserve. There's somebody around you that is, I don't know if they're lying, they're causing a lot of conflict for you. Pay attention to the sirens because that's a message. Remember, I saw those fours, and I got chills in both my arms when I said that. So I don't know if there's some you're gonna somebody's there's gonna be some sirens, okay, in, in your life, or in somebody that you're dealing with. Ace of Swords, Four of Swords, and reversed on the bottom. Ace of Pentacles reversed. Oh my God, you gotta let somebody go. You gotta let something go. This is an unplanned loss. There's somebody that you need to let go of or it has to do with a job or money or something like that. So, or you're dealing with somebody that doesn't want to pay. They don't want to give you, they don't want to give you what's yours. That's what I think it is. I really do. I feel like you're dealing with somebody that is very, very greedy, very selfish. This person is a liar. This person is trying to block you from getting what you deserve who is this person oh my god could be a lawyer uh, well lawyers usually have a client but anyhow um lack of respect for others there's a lack of teamwork there's disrespect here there's dishonesty there's lies last card out is the ace of swords reversed that is you have somebody here that really wants to compete with you. You have a strong competitor here. Five of Wands. Okay, this is strong competition. You are in some sort of strong competition with somebody. This person is lying. They don't tell the truth. They're not very authentic. It's, it's, uh, 
this person is unstable. They're unstable. They may be mentally unstable. They don't have a lot to offer. They don't want to pay. They're going to be fighting with you over it. Get prepared for a challenge. You're, the Nine of Swords or Wands in the overall outcome position, this is a challenge. This is an extreme challenge. The Nine of Wands reversed, okay? This is uh, defending, needing to defend. So you may need to defend yourself. There's defense that is needed. You probably, I feel if this may be a court case. I don't know if it is or something to do with legal matters. Um, but it is going to go in your favor. I do believe it. And it may be over a child. We have we have the page of uh, cups and reversed right over the justice card. So I don't know if this has to do with a child. You're, there's somebody here that is um, going to get their bubble burst. This is tears. It is a rejection. Um, there's no teamwork. There's no togetherness. There's a lack of responsibility. There's somebody here that doesn't isn't very responsible. It, they're lazy. They don't communicate well. They lie a lot. You definitely have a liar around you. This person is very selfish and greedy. They want something that isn't really theirs, you know what I mean? Or they're asking for something that is uh, not practical. It's just not practical at all. Um, I do think that you should expect some trouble. I mean, I hate to say this with the Nine of Wands reversed. I think that you are in a position of authority and you have a strong competitor that is going to... Uh, challenge you. You're going to be dealing with some challenges. You are. Absolutely. You need to, and there's a lack of teamwork. It's like there's no, then there's no, there's miscommunication. There's no communication. The lack of communication is part of the problem. Because when you don't communicate, it makes people's minds go out of control. And it's interesting that I said be warm and not cold. I'm telling you what, there's there's like the silent treatment here. The silent treatment is going to piss somebody off. It's going to cause a fight. It may get somebody blocked. I mean, when, if somebody doesn't respond to me when I have sent them a message, I block them. It's like, fuck you. You don't have time to respond to me. We, we are done. You read it, but you can't respond. And I'm telling you this for a reason. Pay attention to the signs. Every word that comes out of my mouth is part of this reading. That story came out for a reason. There's no communication here. There's a blocked communication. It's like, I'm not going to communicate. Okay. Well, you better get prepared for a fight. You don't want to communicate. Communication is key to any successful relationship. Even if you don't want to deal with this person, the silent treatment is going to cause a challenge. But I don't know, maybe you haven't learned that lesson yet. Or the other person hasn't. <clears throat> we have a battle here. We have a battle. We have a fight. There is going to be a fight, and it's because of no communication. Somebody's going to end up getting blocked or they're going to get, you know, they're going to, this is like unable to master emotions, emotions all over the place. There could be an emotional outburst ahead. This person is hurting. They, they don't know what's going on. They're being blocked. There's blocked communication and uh, boom. Some of you are going to be going to court or you're going to be uh, fighting with somebody. You're going to be fighting with somebody. Yeah, you are. You're going to be fighting with somebody. You're dealing in it. I don't know if it's over a child or over money. Could be a child and money. Could be child support. Could be over the sale of something. Um, torn. You, you know, I feel like you need to open up. You really, 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 really need to open up. We have the two of swords here. That is blocking. You need to open up. You need to uh, communicate. Fucking A. There's communicate here. 
somebody needs to communicate. They're withholding communication. It's going to bring challenges. And I don't know who needs to hear this, but I'm telling you what, there's no communication. we got the Ace of Swords reversed, the Eight of Wands reversed, the Two of Swords, the, the Three of Pentacles reversed. That's no communication. If you do not communicate, there's somebody that you better be communicating with or you're going to be dealing with a much bigger challenge. You heard the sirens twice. Justice in the now position is you got to do the right thing. It's about bringing balance. It's not about winning or losing at this point. It's about mediating, mediating the situation. Oh my God. So, anyway, Leo, I feel like you uh, need to work with somebody and there's refusing to budge. We got it. We got. We got sitting on a high horse. I'm. I'm not. I'm not going to budge. I'm not going to budge. Not going to budge is going to cause this person to have an, an outburst of some sort. And that's a whole nother message. I do feel like. No, let's talk about love now. Okay. That's that's some other situation in your life. In regards to love, I feel as though. You're probably fearful. You're held back by fear. You're fearful. You're fearful of letting your guard down because the Two of Swords is next to the Nine of Wands reverse and the Queen of Pentacles reverse. That's insecure. Insecure. Held back by fear. Torn. Expecting trouble. Do not trust. Been let down so many times. Not opening your heart. Need to listen to your intuition need to open your heart, need to communicate. <laughs> Communication is the main theme of this reading. Okay, you need to communicate, but definitely. You need to open up, you need to take a new approach, you need to be warm, warm. <coughs> I think that they are bringing you some sort of justice. They're realigning you, they're bringing you something that you deserve, but there's some sort of, um, conflict here you're in a state of conflict over whether you should trust this person or you should let them in or you should give them a chance there's somebody around you that is who is this person let's talk about this person for love Five of Cups reverse. You have a new prospect here. Stop focusing on the love that is gone. Stop focusing on the loss. Stop. What if? What if I do this? What if I do that? What if? What if it happens again? Stop doing that. You have an opportunity here with the Five of Cups reverse. That's like a new, seeing a new prospect. You have a new prospect here. Ace of Pentacles upright now. This is a gift. This is a yes. This is somebody that you asked for. This is real. This is solid. This is stable. Okay? You have a golden opportunity right in the palm of your hand that is real. This is something you asked for. It's a new investment. It's a windfall. It's a gift. It's something you can take to the bank. It's something long term. It's something you can hold on to. So you do have a golden opportunity in the palm of your hand. This is something that is very solid. But you have to open up. You need to let go of your fear. You need to take this opportunity and stop expecting trouble. Maybe you're not taking it because you're expecting trouble from the person that causes so much drama in your life. You definitely have somebody here that is very dramatic. Could be a Libra. Could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You are being offered a golden opportunity. This is something that you should take. You should take it. This is a new opportunity for a partnership. 
It is because the Two of Cups and the Five of Cups, this is a partnership. You're being given an opportunity for a partnership where there could be respect, where there could be compatibility, where there could be love. But if you close yourself off emotionally because of fear or because you're torn, because the Two of Swords is torn, it is. It's torn in two different directions, you know? If you're torn, you know, thinking you should give somebody a chance from the past or whatever, to hell with that. No, the answer is no, okay? Use your intuition to make beneficial changes. I feel like you're going to be dealing with some challenges this week with an individual that is unstable. This person doesn't want to give you what you need. They can't give you what you need, whether this is a financial situation or it's a relationship situation. You're definitely going to be dealing with some drama this week. You are. There could be some financial problems as well. You may be going through some financial problems, you know, and you're worried. You're worried about your finances. You're worried about your bank account. Don't worry because you're about, you manifested some sort of security, okay? There is money that is coming. Your money is going to increase. Don't worry about it. Maybe that's what your challenges are. Your challenges could be about money. You're worried about your money, you know? Things aren't, you know, progressing fast enough. The Eight of Wands reverse. Things aren't moving forward fast enough. Maybe you're feeling, you know, like there's the competition is winning or something like that. You know, I don't. I feel like it's all gonna go in your favor. I think you need to master your emotions, focus on the future. Okay, continue to communicate. Continue to open up. Continue to, you know. Uh, not stay back. Do not let your fear hold you back, okay? Keep doing what you're doing because you're, you are, uh, I think you're going through a period of growth or something like that. They have a huge opportunity for you. You just need to not focus on the drama. I don't know if it's haters. You may have some haters here with this five of wands. This could be haters. Okay. Don't focus on the haters. Everything is going to turn out in your favor. The scales are going to balance. You're going to be receiving the success, the victory. You are. You're going to be receiving the the payout that you deserve definitely with the ace of pentacles and the justice card everything is gonna get better use your intuition okay do not let whoever it is that is challenging you block you from what you have been working on Dude, those are your own insecurities. The Queen of Pentacles reverse, that's insecurity. Do not let your own insecurities hinder your success. Three of Wands reverse is unprepared, wasted time, lack of foresight. You may not see that you are about to receive some sort of payout. A windfall or money or something from the hard work that you have done. But you are going to... Do not give up. Do not. Do not. Do not. Do not. I know we were trying to talk about love, but this is the message that they want you to hear. I feel like, I feel like um, you're feeling rejected. Rejection is God's protection. If somebody has rejected you, and the Page of Cups can be rejection and reversed, and it is reversed, if some, this person was disrespectful anyway, they didn't work well with others, they weren't a good match, they would have brought you a lot of challenges, they would have been after your money. If it doesn't work out, it's because they were dishonest. They, there was a lot of competition. This person was a player. It's all right here. You have a new opportunity. You do. This is huge. It may not come until January. It may not. It may be starting to manifest right now. 
because the Ace of Pentacles is manifestation. We have the Queen of Pentacles in reverse up here. In reverse, that's like not really grounded. You need to ground yourself, okay? Maybe you need to block somebody that is causing you a lot of challenges. This person doesn't communicate with you all the time. They only communicate when they feel like it. They have a lot of other options. Maybe you need to let them go. I do believe that you are going to be getting to know somebody else. This is somebody that you can hang on to, somebody that will last, but it will be very slow. I don't see this being a fast situation. This is something where you start to you develop over time. And I and I know because I've done my homework that Leo does not like to go slow. And this does not look like it's fast. But this is an opportunity of a lifetime that can last. It can really, 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 really last. But you have to completely focus on the future. Anyhow, I do believe that, that somebody could get blocked this week. They could get blocked from a, a person that they thought had feelings for them but they don't this is like an unrequited love situation with the page of cups reversed but it all happens for the re for a reason this is everything turning out as it should this person isn't dishonest and i think there's angel protection it is dishonest and i think there's angel protection here i feel like there's another opportunity just as quick just as immediately after as soon as you stop focusing on it. So the timing's on you, right? You are unprepared for an arrival. Remember, I saw the Knight of Swords. Somebody is, is coming in very, very, very fast. And you may not know what to do. Maybe it's because you've just been rejected. Good luck.